Hi everyone, it's me. Um, I just woke up, so if you're new here, then you're like, why? Why do you look like that? It's because I just woke up. If you're not new here, you're like, hey, it's been a long time. And it has been a while since we got a new Miraculous episode. And it's also been a while since I cleared out the USD card of my camera. So we're starting off like this. And the lights are off because I just woke up and I ain't, I ain't gonna turn the lights on. My mom is also asleep down the hall, so... I promise you I'll probably get loud because hello, hello, um, but yeah, we have a new Miraculous episode, we're gonna react to it, uh, well, well I, I try not to get spoiled, but, um, <sighs> Cat Noir gives up his Miraculous, and I'm pretty sure Adrian, I'm pretty sure Adrian gets it, so, let's see how this goes. So is she asking how Adrian got the miraculous? Because Marinette, you're a freaking idiot. He got it because he's Cat Noir. Like, I don't understand. Oh, dude, I love Plag. He's like a king. He is a king. We need to get him a crown because I love Plag. I do. I do. I love him. And he's finally telling Ladybug what the entire fandom wants to tell her. And if he would just slap her, he would be what we all want. He would do what we all want. You know what I mean? I wish he would slap her. Okay. Anyway. Um, but yeah. Wow. I'm like very happy that he's telling her off because honestly, Marinette needs to be told off. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did he really just delete every single one of his ladybug pictures one by one? I feel even more bad for him because he doesn't know the beauty of being able to just click and then drag and then just click delete for multiple pictures. He's gonna get his mind blown. Where in the world did she get this robotic setup? <laughs> is it like a sentu monster that he made? Like what is this? What in the world, where did she get that? Like Felix? He's just gonna end up acting like Felix. You don't know him that well. You don't know him that well. And you deserve. If that was Cat Noir, I'd be so proud. I'd be like, yes! Hit her over the face. It would be great. Uh, I'm very glad she got hit into a building because um, she deserves it. But um, it's like Cat Noir. She doesn't know him as good as she thinks. Mm. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sorry, I'm just like. <sighs> Marinette's absolutely being a fool, and I absolutely cannot watch it. Like. Oh, it was so convenient that he just so happened to be pushing a lawnmower not that long ago and was dumping it in his truck. It's just so perfect. Yes, Cat Noir is your true self. Come on, Adrian. We've known this since season one. Since season one. Deep down, Adrian, you are a fun, super amazing cat who's being dragged down into the depths of boring seriousness and perfectness by your father. And Marinette, deep down, is an absolute stalker who sucks. Huh. So was this the episode where she kissed him on the cheek and I just missed it? I mean, it must have been, right? But 
Oh, here we go. Still not satisfied. CN gave her forgave her so easy, and Catwalker was growing on me. Yeah, see, Cat Noir. He's a simp for Ladybug, so he forgives her pretty easily. But still, same thing as usual. Nothing really happens, and Adrian's feelings don't affect the relationship of, between him and Ladybug. I think the season finale will be the same lame stuff without consequences. Yes. I definitely agree. I just, I don't, I don't think Lady, but I don't think this show's getting stale because like, it has good ideas. But with this, it's so obsessed with having this formulaic, episodic part. You just one episode after another. They're so obsessed with having this formula that we don't ever get to explore these points. Like, Ladybug figured out that she needed Cat Noir, like the first thing like right after catwalker so like it would have been better if we had catwalker for a couple of episodes and we got to see how they struggled though i really had a lot of trouble watching uh, a ladybug be baronet and not be able to think stuff out around him for really really enjoyed that um i didn't enjoy that but it would have been cool if we had Catwalker for a couple of episodes, right? And we got to explore this new dynamic where Ladybug tried to include Cat Noir in every single mission because she wants him to. She doesn't want. She doesn't want Catwalker to feel like Cat Noir did, where she she's not. He's not needed, right? So I think it would have been cool if we had that progression, but we don't get that. And then Cat Noir just instantly, like, takes Ladybug back. Like, yeah, I felt like she didn't even talk through his feelings. Which is really stupid because so... Because the reason he gave up his miraculous is a really big deal because he feels useless to her. And now, just because he has Catwalker, he saw that he's not needed for every single mission... But, like, he didn't get to talk through Ladybug his problems. He didn't get to say, like, you know, Ladybug, I just feel useless when you don't include me and stuff. And that's, like, he didn't get to talk about it. We didn't talk about it. And com communication is key in a relationship. It is the most important thing, no matter what relationship you have, romantic, friendly, enemies right like you can't be enemies with someone if you don't know why you hate them communication is important and we just don't get any in this show because they never want to progress anything past one episode past one episode and also you know i forgot what i was gonna say what was i gonna say oh right um and also uh like, Cat Noir was needed for every single mission for those first three seasons. So why is it now in season four that you don't need him anymore, Ladybug? Why is it now that you don't need him, Ladybug? Because you technically still did at the end. He went and found the cat. Is it her cat? Who knows? It could just be a random black cat, and he just so happened to get lucky. Like, I don't know. Um, but, like, he was needed for every episode of the first three seasons, and now he's not needed anymore. And it just, it's so, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just looking at Miraculous very uh, critically. I'm trying, like, I'm trying to find the good in it. But, like, this episode had sad Adrian. And it was good. Like, he had feelings. And I love him and Plague together. But it doesn't go anywhere because it was solved by the end. And I get Miraculous is uh, episodic, so stuff happens in one episode and it stops. But we have an entire first half of season four plot with Alia getting her Miraculous. Like, the, and Ladybug telling her that she's Ladybug, right? So it it's happened before that we've had uh, something happen for multiple plots, and I don't understand why... <sighs> I don't understand why this show can't have its full potential. <laughs> it hurts me because this show could be so good. It could be so freaking good. But it just won't. It just, it'll never be as good as it can be. And it's really sad. It's really sad. Uh, but I guess I'm gonna log off and edit this. 
yay uh thanks for watching this tell me what you guys think in the comment section down below i'm sorry that we don't have a dislike button on these videos anymore because you guys really like to dislike me so if you want to dislike me um just tell me in the comments be like yay i hate your video and that's fine too i i'm sorry if you don't have a dislike button but uh feel free to tell me in the comments if you want to um yeah i'm gonna go love you all so much thanks for watching this video and hopefully the next episode we get will be better i don't have high hopes but we can hope Bye, everyone. And hey, don't forget, I'm still a freaking bulldozer. I'm just one who needs to clean out her USD card. Bye, guys.